tired with same boring view on your Android TV box? Well, change the view. The TV launcher I have for you today, it's called DJ Sender XDS Live OS Launcher. And it's available, as you can see, at the Play Store. And it's free. So simply go to Play Store, look it up, um, find it, and uh, install it. Then, so once you click Home, the application is very straightforward. The uh, launcher is very simple. You got a couple of uh, uh, areas. Uh, there's app uh, on the left side, apps on the left side, that's your app drawer. So if you click on app drawer, you'll see all of your applications um, that are not in your favorites and all that stuff. You just see an entire list. Uh, let's go back to it. Then you got your weather, uh, indication of what kind of network you're connected to, time. Right below that, you got your favorites, trending, which is kind of nice. I like trending because uh, we don't always watch the news, but here it is latest news in there, movies, all kind of new stuff that's going on that you can very easily uh, click and uh, check uh, check it out, what's going on, to so get up to date. And right below that is your popular or most frequently used applications. And they come up there. And also XDS Live, this is their personal session. They do have, looks like, some services and that you can subscribe to. Uh, I have not tried that, but you're more than welcome. Otherwise, this is it. Uh, very simple, very smooth, very uh, clean um, looking uh, launcher. Highly recommend it. I've been using it now for a few days and I like it. I like it very much. You do need to uh, use a mouse for certain things. So if you have a remote without a mouse, I highly recommend, I recommend getting one. Well, I highly recommend getting one no matter what because, again, Android uh, TV boxes, uh, you know, when the good, especially the good ones, they use uh, basically any application out there and most of the applications are not designed for your remotes they're designed for touch screens and what's the next best thing uh, after touch screen it's a mouse so get something get some sort of remote with a mouse get a keyboard that has a, a touchpad something like that and you will enjoy it you will love it there's quite a few more other launches and applications that you will like and it will bring some more of them for you in uh, weeks to come. Thank you for watching, and I hope to see you here next time.